Last one, center squat. Beautiful, roll the ball to me. Don't forget to go deep into the squats. It's not time for a break yet. Still working the glutes, but from a different angle. It's great to work the same muscle, especially a large muscle like the glutes, at different angles to create challenge. Curl slow, heel to the rear. Oh, I know, the muscles are already burning and now we're adding something else. It's a challenge. Now we're really targeting the hamstrings. Knees in and release. Three, beautiful. Can you get your hips a little bit higher without creating strain on the lower back? Right here, down, push off. There's your second set of eight coming. The fitness ball versus a hard bench because it's forcing me to work my core, to engage it the entire time I'm working. So that's a bonus, you can't get on a hard bench. Lower back is supported by the ball and the core is still engaged to keep you stable. Good. Now can we try it a little bit faster for eight? Let's go, fly. Now the great thing, four. Fantastic. Strong arms, strong shoulders. As you get stronger, by the way, I encourage you to go heavier in weights. Eight, straight up basic crunch. The basic crunch can be unbelievably effective when you're using the ball. So now we're targeting the obliques of the body. Good, four more. Nice. Now, from the top to the bottom and the bottom to the top. Really important on this exercise that you try to maintain that neutral spine for the lower back. Squat with a bounce and toss. Take it left, bounce, toss. Now same goes for the Putting those two together, use the room you have. Nice job, I need four more, that's only two each way, you can do this. Try two, two, push, two, push. Just jump straight up. If you're not familiar with it, I know the ball is a great tool for instability, but it's a bit of a challenge at first. Deeper. And this time, as you roll back, straighten the right leg, come up tall, and again. Now as you roll forward, keep that right leg straight and hinge forward at the hips. Right hip is going to be on the ball and we're going into kind of a staggered runner stretch. Squeeze the glutes once again, that will drive the hip forward. And the great thing about using the stability ball now for this stretch is you're gonna be able to get a little bit deeper stretch here.